Hey, I'm Albert from Muffin Group and from now on I will be making a video tutorials about the Bee Theme and the Bee Builder. If you have any feedback about this video or just want me to make a tutorial about something you don't know how to use, feel free to leave me a comment and I will do my best to help you. Ok, so let's move on to the topic. I'm really excited to present you a new setup wizard we released with 26.5 version of the Bee Theme. This tool will take even the most beginners through installation process. Previous websites importer we had so far would work as well but has been redesigned but I will show it to you later. So the setup wizard is divided into two steps. In the first step you have to decide if you want to install one of our built-in Preble website or maybe you want to create a new project from scratch. First, I will discuss the option related to pre-built websites. Let's get started then. In this step, we have to set the site title and the tagline. In case, you can change them easily later in the settings, general tab. Let's move on to the next step where you can choose the text editor you prefer to work with. Visual is the WYSIWYG editor that we recommend especially for the beginners. The other one, Code, which is Code Mirror with syntax highlighting, is a great choice for those who want to work with short codes, raw HTML, etc. Within this editor, you have better control over what you do, but it's recommended for the advanced users mainly. If you would like to know them both better, just click on not sure, compare both link below the options to watch the video where we compared both editors. Alright, let's move on to the next step. Here, you can check the category or categories that suit your business type best. Otherwise, just skip the step what I'm gonna do right now. And the next step, we're going to choose the builder we would like to work with. We strongly recommend to use the B Builder as it is 100% built in house and is way lighter, faster, and definitely more stable than any other website builder on the market, like Elementor, for example. Moreover, it has a lot of great features that others just doesn't have. The BB Builder is also based on Flexbox what gives you seriously infinite possibilities of designing. Lots of our customers already switch from more popular page builders and they enjoy the Bee Builder even more. We are pretty sure you're gonna love it too. Great, so now we can finally choose the pre-built website we would like to install. You have a lot of options to sort them by like layout or subject. Let's say I want to install the B Business 6 layout. If you are not sure how specific pre-built website looks like, you can click on the eye icon that appears on the image hover. By going to the next step, we can choose if you want to install complete website with media or slider. Your site would look like exactly the same as on the demo. Otherwise, you can install selected data only, like content, theme options or slider revolution. Let's install complete website and hop in to the next step. This is the last step where you can see what will be finally installed with website. In this case, plugins like Contact Form 7 and Slider Revolution which are required for complete installation. Let's click Start Installation button. On click, Setup Wizard will ask you about the database reset. If you don't want to remove exa existing content like posts, pages, etc., then just skip the step. However, if you want to have a clean installation, just check the checkbox 
and click delete. Great! Installation process have just started. Now you have to wait until it's finished. Installation time depends on many things like server speed, pre-built website size, the distance between your and our server and many other things on which we do not have any impact. So please be patient while installation, as in some cases, it might take a little bit longer. Awesome! We have just gone through all the steps and now we can check our website. As you can see, it looks exactly the same as on the pre-built website. Let's get back to the setup wizard and if you look on the right side of the button we just clicked, we put some links to most important sources like documentation, video tutorials, FAQ, etc. We would be grateful if you can rate our setup wizard by clicking on the right icon just under how much do you like a text. Okay, so uh, now we can go back to the first step. Uh, so we can go through the second way and create our new project from scratch. Second step is the same as above. So all you have to do is set the site title and the tagline or just skip the step as you can define these details anytime you want in the settings general tab in the main WordPress dashboard. As in case of the pre-built website installation, uh, I just already talked above. Uh, in the third step, you need to decide which text editor you prefer to use. And the fourth step is the one where the whole creating from the scratch begins. In this step, you can choose header from the list of the default headers or set uh, the one from predefined list. Whatever you do here, uh, the window with a preview of your website on the left side will refresh live. Let's choose the header then, maybe this one. And also, let's set the logo. I will set the one from the media library. Okay, the logo has changed. And maybe let's set the footer from the list of the predefined footers. All right, uh, so let's move on to the next step. Uh, and here we can choose the font type. No worries, you can change this font later. These are just examples that our customers like most. So as you can see, if you click on the font, uh, this font changes directly uh, on the left side and the website preview. And the next step, you can define the color palette. Uh, these are only illustrative palettes because you can define colors as you like globally in theme options or locally in the B Builder. But if you just click these colors, you will see that these colors will change in the website preview. Let's hop into the next step where you can choose the plugins you would like to install. If you are not sure which plugins you need yet, just skip the step as you can install them later. I'm going to just skip them. Alright, so we can start our installation now. And this process is way much faster than in case of the pre-built website because there is no need to import things like media, huge amount of content and other things. Okay, so we just went for both steps of the setup wizard. As you can see, the whole process is extremely simple and won't take you more than just a couple of minutes. We hope you like it and from now on, we'll be using it in your future projects. That is all for this video. Thanks for watching and remember to like, subscribe and click the bell icon to get notified every time we release a new video. If you have more questions, please visit our support center at support.muffingroup.com.